All right, so it's day three. We just checked out of the hostel. I'm gonna jump on the train here to uh, Cork. Yeah, and Shane's great in holding everything. I got for all the, the stuff. love. <laughs> So there's our QR code. He needed to check our reservations because we don't just like swipe them. So there's our train. The guy helped us. He's like, just show it to me. And I was like, okay. Very nice. Right, Time to go. We're here. Welcome to Cork. Interesting dentist right here. It's crazy. Sheila's hospital. Well, fine. Going up here. I'll give you a yo, what up, MTV Cribs. Okay, what up, MTV Cribs? We made it to our place. We're at Sheila's. What we got to look at, Jane? Yo, what up, MTV Cribs? You're in the the master bedroom right here. We got a three bed setup going. This is where the magic happens. Oh my God, don't put that <laughs> But yeah, we got a nice little room, nice private room, first one on the trip after two hostel uh, bunk rooms. When we were staying in Dublin, there was a, uh, we spent two nights in a 12 person bunk room. And now I'm sick too. Now Maggie's a little sick, but it's going around. Hopefully we get it out of the way now. And when we're in uh, colder climates, it won't hit us as hard. But uh, yeah, looking forward to having our own room after two nights in the bunk room weren't bad, but a little bit, people leaving lights on and stuff. No, Snoring. Nothing too bad. Nothing. Some earplugs. Yeah, not too bad. But, but we're going to go get some lunch and uh, explore Cork a little bit. And then we're going to meet up with one of my really good friends. So that's exciting. Uh, pharmacy to get medicine. All right, so we got uh, a piece of chicken and three... It's 8.20, we just got back from seeing my friend, Maria Yosu. She is Irish from Kerry and he is Basque from, I think outside of San Sebastian. But oh my gosh, I am definitely feeling more and more sick as the time goes on. I tried to keep my distance from them and be like, oh, sorry, I'm not feeling so great. But we got to spend some time with them and I just had a tea and it was so fun catching up. Maria and I used to work in the Basque country teaching English together. So I hadn't seen her in like maybe four years or something. So that's kind of why I powered through to see them. And it was so lovely. They're just really, really great. And um, we went to this fabulous pub. I think it's called like Cine, S-I-N, and then an E with a, a little asterisk thing. But it was great. Everyone was so nice and they had some live music. And now I'm back in bed. I'm so happy. I just need to sleep and we have some medicine. So I'm just gonna take it easy. And then Shane went to go get some snacks, and we were going to call it a day. But Cork is beautiful, and it is nice to be out and about and just have some time to rest. I'm so happy that we have, like, a very loose schedule. But okay, wish me luck. Hopefully I'll heal up soon. Bye! It's raining. We're leaving the hostel. We're still sick. We're going to Galloway. Made it to Galway, walking to our hostel, feeling better, and we're gonna check out this Christmas market. I'm here with my Galway girl, love yes. of my life, yes, Maggie you are. Berry. Oh, lovey. Oh God. <laughs> Taking our first lift up to our hostel room. We have a private room tonight, which is great. 
feeling a bit better, which is really nice. And it was a pretty good day to take the train. We had to do like a transfer over, but it wasn't too bad. It's pretty rainy today, so yeah. we're both not feeling too great. So it was a nice day to just sit and catch up on the internet and our journals. And we're welcome to Galway. Galway. You. Shane's like, you want me to stand in front of the sign? I was like, no, get out of the way. <laughs> Interesting. It seems a lot like fried dough, which Shane loves, so. Are you Mrs. Claus? Are you Mrs. Claus? Could be, one day. All right, it's probably 6.30 now, maybe seven. I don't know, it's a little bit later, but we walked all around, which is really nice. And we were eating some chicken and pesto pasta, which is great, and then having a tea. And we we're trying to figure out our plans for the next couple days. And then look, Shane bought me this lovely ring. Um, it's like a traditional, what is it called? Clotter ring. Clotter ring. So we're gonna go to the museum and check it out and we got it green for Ireland. So I'm really excited and happy about that. I love it. Uh, I think maybe when we first started dating, he got me a ring, but it broke, I think after the first year. So it's nice to have a ring again. Good night.